YouTube was shaking, man. Yo, what's good, man? Yo, yo, peace, 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 family. How you, man? Yo, you know what it says, man. It's no face to rambler, man. I've been in a good space, man. Just grinding, working, man. Trying to get to the next bag, man. Bigger bag, better level. You know what I'm saying? But, um, I want to get my spill right quick, man. I want to drop this on y'all, man. It's in regards of, um, this brother that got killed in the Bronx, man. Um, Money Gang Vante. You know what I'm saying? And, um, I, 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 I just want to get my spill on this, man, because I'm seeing a real occurring theme of, of, of young brothers, man, putting themselves in situations, man, that leads to something real detrimental. You know what I'm saying? All facts, my nigga. And I, I'm, I'm, I'm keep it. I'm, I'm going to keep it a million. I'm going to keep it a million with my subscribers, man. And I'm going to keep it a million with my out-of-state, my out-of-town family. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to go ahead and break down to y'all, man, NYC wave. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and understand, man, this, this ain't no video about, you know, NYC versus this state or, you know, this state's harder than this state or city to city. This ain't got nothing to do with none of that, my nigga. Because speaking on this, man, Money Game Vante, man, and, and his death... In the manner of his death, in the way that he died, I, I, I got to keep it a million with y'all, man. I, I don't blame the young niggas for doing what the fuck they was doing. The niggas was playing their part, man. And I ain't trying to sound cold or nothing like that. They was playing their part. Niggas is out there hungry, man. I don't blame Money Gang Vante for not having security or none of that shit, my nigga. But I'm going to tell you who I will blame. And who I do blame... It's the internet. You YouTube blogging niggas. You niggas that go on IG Live, Facebook Live. You niggas all in the comments section. And the reason I'm blaming you niggas, man, because you got a history, man, of, of painting false narratives, painting false pictures, my nigga. And, and, and you indoctrinate the public with that bullshit, my nigga. You understand? You indoctrinate the public with that bullshit, man, and particularly our youth. You feel what I'm saying? Stop fucking clout chasing. Stop clout chasing. Stop promoting clout chasing. Stop fronting. Because what happened in the Bronx a couple of days ago, that's exactly the end result of this shit. And in particular, man, you know, I, I'm going to speak about where the fuck I'm from, man. I'm going to speak about my city, man. I'm going to speak about my city. Because cause niggas got a, got, a, got a real gripe with, with, with where the fuck I'm from. And, and this shit goes all the way back to, to this East Coast, West Coast, Tupac, Biggie War type shit. And I've been telling niggas about this shit, man. Stop painting these false pictures, my nigga. Stop painting pictures like like Suge Knight was in any type of projects at NYC or Long Island and shit, sitting on a bench, smoking a cigar, smacking niggas on the block. Stop painting pictures like that, my nigga. All you little weird YouTube bloggers and niggas in the comment section, that's what the fuck you doing. And young niggas is listening to you, and this is the picture and the image they got about New York City, as if it's some type of fucking theme park. Big niggas, you know what I'm saying? Outlaw niggas and the Napoleon them niggas, two Tupac's mans and shit, man. Sit up here talking about, you know, niggas, niggas, niggas press Nas in, in, in New York, man, in, in, in the fucking park. In, in, in Bryant Park. If niggas from out of state to out of town, they don't know what the fuck Bryant Park is. So these niggas is thinking, you know, Bryant Park probably sits in Harlem somewhere or probably sit off in Queens somewhere in the hood where these niggas is from. And it's not the case. Brian Park is of a fucking a, a park, Midtown Manhattan, basically, where old white women walk their dogs, play yoga, type shit. You feel what I'm saying? It's a very peaceful environment, man. When when Suge and these niggas is coming out here, niggas is going to the tourist attraction spots, my nigga. Tourist places and shit. Niggas, niggas ain't going to to, to the lower class. To the slums of NYC, man. 
And this is what you niggas is missing, and this is what you niggas got to understand. Stop painting these fucking pictures, man. Stop painting these fucking pictures, man. I heard one YouTuber talking some insane shit with the whole, you know, East Coast, West Coast war talking about, you know, Tupac had, had, had niggas in Queens, and, and these niggas was going to press mob deep in Queensbridge, my nigga, in the early to mid-90s. What the fuck are you talking about, man? Like, and this is the shit that I'm talking about, bro. This is the shit that I'm talking about, bro. Like, stop with the bullshit, my nigga. Because you putting people, particularly cats from out of state and out of town, man, you putting these niggas in harm way, man. Because motherfuckers are believing this shit. Motherfuckers are believing this shit. Dead ass, man. Facts. Niggas are believing this shit. You YouTube blogging ass niggas, man. You little weird niggas in the comment section, man. You niggas is, is sitting up here with whatever little gripe that you got with NYC and shit, man. And y'all niggas is painting these very distorted bullshit pictures, my nigga. And I'm going to tell you, man, as a New Yorker, man, we're not a city that have a small city complex, my nigga. Niggas in the streets of New York don't have nothing to prove, dog. And niggas in the streets of New York, man, way before Bloods and Crips came along to the city, man, Never gave a fuck about rappers, man. Understand that. 90% of niggas in New York City, man, when it come to any rap acts or entertainers, entertainers coming from the West or wherever the fuck they come from, niggas are not invested in New York. Niggas are not invested in trying to ride for fucking Biggie or Pop Smoke, my nigga. Because it's music. Music in the streets is separate, my nigga. And I told you niggas this shit, man, in countless videos, man. Stop with the bullshit narratives, man. Stop painting these bullshit pictures, man. And I, I'm just keeping it a million, my nigga. You ain't gonna go to no hood in NYC, any borough, none of that. And niggas is sitting on the park bench shooting dice, smoking weed with bottles of Henny, going around the cypher, sitting up here talking about what niggas in Detroit, niggas in LA, Chicago, and anywhere else is doing, my nigga. Niggas is not on that type of time. In the city, man. Niggas wake up every fucking morning in New York City, man. And their only goal is how the fuck I'm going to get this guap. How I'm going to get this money, man. How I'm going to get this fucking bag up. My daughter, my niece, my son, my nephew, my little brothers, my little sisters, man, they need things. My peoples need help with rent or the mortgage. That's the type of time niggas is on, man. Because if, if, if Biggie or Pop Smoke, my nigga, was in the Bronx and, and they was maneuvering and moving like Money Gang Vante, they would have caught the same action, man. They would have caught the same fucking action. Niggas probably wouldn't have bodied them, but they would have caught the same action. Niggas don't give a fuck about rappers and shit out here, man. Niggas in NYC ain't in tune with what anybody else is doing, bro. Please stop this promoting of this clout chasing bullshit, bro. Stop that bullshit, bro. Stop listening to niggas like Whack 100 because you hear this bullshit on Clubhouse, my nigga. These niggas got a good job talking shit and hiding, my nigga. Niggas ain't out here, man. They got, they got niggas... They got young dudes, man, out of town, out of out of state of NYC, man, thinking that, that, that rappers are coming out here, man, just doing and doing whatever the fuck they want to do. And it's not what it is, man. Niggas in, in every city, in every state, in, in every hood, man, is basically on the same type of wave, bro. Stop being pimped by this machine, my nigga. And that's facts, man. It's no face to rambler, man. I'm signing out, man. You know how we rock, man. It's pro love and no love, man.
For all you young up and coming rappers, man, my advice, man, get your money, stay the fuck out the way, stuck, stay sucker free, and most of all, man, focus on staying alive, my nigga. Enjoy yourself. Peace.